Kelly get an invite to the checkout? It is gonna get here. That's all right. I re I refill. Does R. Kelly get an invite to the cookout? Yes, no, and why? Nah. R. Kelly, R. as in the singer? Yep. No. No, and why? I just don't like what I've heard thus far. Does R. Kelly get an invite to the cookout? No. First question is Does R. Kelly get an invite to the cookout? Hell no. <laughs> no, no, it's too late for him. And like, why? It's too late only because he definitely took advantage of community's trust, especially young black women, and taking advantage using his um, privilege and power to over, you know, to control. You know what I'm saying? So, it, I'm, nah, he can't. Like, it's easy. No. Like, yeah. Why <laughs> not? Um, he ain't right. <laughs> oh, he ain't right, my J. Um, I don't want any predators around my kids, so that's that on that. Makes sense. Does R. Kelly get an invite to the cookout? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, yeah. No. Then why not? No. No, he's canceled. All the shit he did to those girls, no way. He's basically a symbol of the sexual harassment in this country, the passes that we give males, black and white, in this country to... How they treat our women is just not appropriate. We need to treat women better across the country, black or white, and R. Kelly is defaming the black community, unfortunately. So. You trash. <laughs> <laughs> so we so we can talk to him and, and listen to what's going on in, in, with him. Gotcha. No. R. Kelly get an invite to the cookout. No. And why not? Because our family's gonna be there. It's gonna be too many little girls, you know, and he just gonna be trying to Get at all of them. <laughs> but I mean, what he done is like, it wasn't cool, so yeah, exactly. who would want to invite somebody like right. that no, to their cookout? Like Gladys Knight singing at the Super Bowl this year. Yes, no. No, 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 I don't. <laughs> Not that? even a little bit. Because uh, the NFL ain't right, and they still cheating for Tom Brady, so they really ain't right. <laughs> Do you agree with Gladys Knight singing at the Super Bowl? Yes or no? No. Yes. And why is that? Because she got to make her money. Question, do you agree with Gladys Knight singing at the Super Bowl? Yes, no, and why? Yes. And why? She's a legend. That one's tough. I feel like people need to be able to get their money how they can, um, but I also do feel like in solidarity of the black community and in solidarity of Colin Kaepernick, that's probably a no for me, but people do need to make their money how they can. No. No. Nope. It's unfortunate, even though she's a legend, but just the situation with, you know, kind of like a commodification of um, just the NFL stance in terms of um, how they view players, um, how they view black people, and the commodification of people, and standing for, you know, standing against things like Black Lives Matters, and you know, especially Colin Kaepernick. Like, you know, our community needs to be more for, you know, standing in unison in terms of like, you know, companies that don't promote things that are worth, you know, for us, you know what I'm saying? Because we need to support Kaepernick. That's right. My nigga. <laughs> no. I didn't even know that was happening, but hell no. No. And why not? Because why would she do that? We're not supposed to be supporting anybody in the Super Bowl. Like, they don't even fuck with black people. Why do black people continuously support the white man when he doesn't do anything for us, like, at all? Sorry. Getting very passionate. No, no, no. I feel like, um... When one of us stand for something, we all should kind of stand for it, you know. Even if it's, even if it's like you're getting paid for it, it's just like letting things pass. Just because, like, you know, just because you're getting paid and letting things pass, that doesn't make it right, you know. You're supposed to stand for your people. Right, I yeah. feel like, you know, I didn't really answer that right, no, but. <laughs>